Hello! So today we're going to learn how to load in a custom reference into Vermilion on the Quest 2. So to do this you're going to need an Oculus Quest and then you're going to need a smartphone uh, or a laptop or a computer and then of course Vermilion the application loaded onto the Quest 2 that you're using. So start by finding the image that you want to use as a reference and then save that onto a web application such as Instagram, uh, Facebook, send it to yourself in Facebook Messenger or any other cloud sharing service that you uh, want to be able to log into and view. So next you want to load up Vermilion and then while starting a new canvas click the globe at the very top this will bring up the browser make sure you're clicking on the magnifying glass and not searching within YouTube which tends to be the default enter the URL of the service that you want to use so is it Facebook, uh, is it Google Docs uh, in this case it might be Instagram load it up. You will need a login, providing that you put the photo on there. Enter your details. And then once you've signed in, you'll be able to see your Instagram post. Click on profile, or whether it's in private messages, and then you can load up all of your images. So you can move this around and use it as a reference. So you can paint and copy them direct. Or if you like, you can click the projector and move it around. You can resize, um, and that's just in case you want to adjust the uh, opacity of the projection. And this way, you can get, you know, if you wanted to trace any areas, get your proportions right. You can even choose to overlay, which will make it a bit more um, clear to see over any paint that you've got. Again, you can adjust that as well. Uh, and that's it really, that's how you get your, your references. And to get rid of them, you can just tap the projector again and, and it's gone. So that's how you load in a custom reference into Vermilion. So you can use projector, or you can just have it mounted anywhere you feel that you need to copy. So it's quite a useful tool if you want to do any uh, commissioning work or if you want to paint a personal picture. Um, these are paintings that I've done previously, um, so I'm not afraid to share these. Um, but yeah, any questions, let me know.